Yardley Reynolds Love was born July 17, 1987 and left this world May 3, 2010. Yardley was born in Baltimore, Maryland to John and Sharon Love. She resided in Cockeysville, Maryland. At Notre Dame's prep school, Love was a member of the varsity lacrosse and field hockey team all four years and was a all-country lacrosse player in 2006. She was admitted to the University of Virginia, where she majored in political science and majored in Spanish. She was also a member of the sorority Kappa Alpha Theta. As a member of the UVA women's lacrosse team, the Cavaliers, Love scored her first goal in her first game, playing against Virginia Tech. She started in nine of her 16 games in 2009 and in three of her 15 games in 2010. Let's take a deeper dive into the death of Yardley Love. The murder of Yardley Love took place on May 3rd, 2010 in Charlottesville, Virginia. Love, a University of Virginia women's lacrosse student athlete, was found unresponsive in her Charlottesville apartment later that day. UVA men's lacrosse player George Wesley Hughley was arrested by Charlottesville police. Hughley was tried and found guilty of Love's murder. Around 2.15 a.m. on May 3, 2010, Charlottesville police were called to Love's apartment on 14th Street in the university's corner district. At the scene, Love was found unresponsive and was pronounced dead. The 911 call from Love's roommate reported that she suffered an alcohol overdose, but detectives noticed obvious physical injuries to her body upon arrival. The suspect, George Hughley, was living next door. On May 4th, Hughley was charged with the murder of Love and was held in the Charlottesville Regional Jail. At a May 6th court appearance, his attorney, Fran Lawrence, said, Mrs. Love's death was not intended, but an accident with a tragic outcome. Hughley appeared at the hearing VIA video. Hughley and Love dated over the course of two years, but had broken up. At the Charlottesville police station, Hughley waived his Miranda rights and narrated the graphic details of the assault on Love. Stating that he kicked open her locked bedroom door and shook Love, and her head repeatedly hit the wall. Furthermore, Hughley admitted that he took and intended to destroy her Apple laptop computer when he fled from her apartment. Evidence that police seized from Hughley's apartment included two Apple laptop computers, a spiral notebook, two white socks, bathroom and entryway rugs, and a Virginia lacrosse shirt with a red stain. Investigators also followed leads of domestic violence between Hughley and Love, including threatening emails and text messages that were sent to her post breakup. A violent encounter between the couple that was broken up by several visiting lacrosse players from the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill and the incident in which Hughley attacked Love while drunk but did not recall having hit her. An unnamed student reported that the couple broke up after the drunken Hughley assaulted Love. She is now memorialized by the One Love Foundation. On May 8, 2012, nine jurors for the first time were able to see Hughley in a 64-minute video in which he was told of Love's death. As he was interrogated by the police, Hughley admitted, quote, I may have grabbed her neck and maybe I shook her a little bit, unquote. He then retells the argument and fight that happened in Love's bedroom, demonstrating how he shook her and kicked her door. Eventually, the detectives inform Hughley that Love is dead. Hughley reacts in disbelief and says, quote, kill me, unquote, 
Because of the raw emotion seen in this tape, the jury was convinced that Love's murder was not premeditated. On August 30th, 2012, Hughley was formally sentenced to 23 years in prison by Judge Edward Horshire, with a sentence of 23 years for the second degree murder conviction and one year for the grand larceny conviction to run concurrently. Privilege to recognize all that Yardley achieved as a student at UVA and all the potential she had in life by awarding a posthumous degree, the Bachelor of Arts in Government. Are you ready, Lauren? Yardley Reynolds, Love. Love wore jersey number one while playing lacrosse for UVA, and the team retired her number. Within months of her murder, her family established the One Love Foundation to raise awareness about domestic violence, especially relationship violence. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Thanks for watching Death After Sports, Yortley Love.